today with another video but before i get started on all the details please make sure to hit the subscribe button if you aren't subscribed to my channel already and also if you are subscribed to my channel please make sure to turn those notifications on so you don't miss out on any of my videos i'll be showcasing a unit today from the company my first wig you guys know i have worked with them plenty of times before i'm gonna make sure to leave some unboxing down below for you guys or on the screen somewhere but we're gonna go ahead and jump into this beauty right here today i'm going to be showcasing a pixie cut bob this is what it looks like right here this is a yakky texture i'm going to show you guys what the construction looks like you do get a 13 by 6 and you can tell they did go in and bleach the knot so you get two combs on the side that's all that parting space right here also get a comb in the back your adjustable straps and you also get an adjustable elastic band if this unit is seven to ten inches it is a little bit shorter on one side and it also states that this is 160 percent in density i really want to try to rock this unit glueless so i do have my darker wig cap so i'm just going to place it back here and then I'm going to kind of move my sideburns out of the way because I don't want to mess them up. I'm just going to brush all that out of the way. All right. Just move it out of the way. And then I have my silicone grip. So I'm just going to place that on right here. And just kind of brush everything out of the way. Let's see if I can pull this up. Hopefully y'all don't hear the noise that I'm hearing because it is trash day and the recycle people are coming around and they're pretty loud. So, all right. So I have that on and then I adjusted my straps in the bag, but maybe I don't need to adjust them. So we're going to see because I definitely want to have this comfortable in the back, but I am going to tighten up this. I'm just going to use this first little hook right here. So this is fitting on me pretty good. I don't have no issues with the fit as of now. And I know it looks a little crazy, but you guys know I'm gonna get it together. As you can see, this is parted on the left. And if you part this on the right, you won't get that shorter, you know, effect because you see how it's like longer over here. And then it's like shorter and more layered over here. So I'm not gonna move, you know, that parting space or whatever. And you can see like the length over here on this side but let's go ahead and get into this hairline the hairline is plucked it's plucked okay it looks really good so i'm not gonna have to go in and do anything those knots are very very small like i'm pretty sure you guys can see them but they're very small which i love and then i want to show you guys this parting space so you can part this you know in other ways but like i said you're not going to get that shorter you know pixie bob look if you part this in the middle but the parting is definitely there if you want to move it around the yakky texture once again so it looks really nice it's not shiny it looks very natural and so far it is looking good it is a little bit kind of humpy up here so i am going to have to go in and kind of fix that and I'm noticing like a little bit of flyaways, but I'm going to get that together. But let me just go ahead and get to working on this unit. Got hair everywhere. But let me go ahead and get to working on this unit. And then, of course, you guys will see the final look. And I'll come back with my final thoughts.
definitely give it off a grown look for sure. I like how easy it was for me to install this. I use my Nairobi mousse to go around the hairline area and I also have all my silicone grip bobby pins on the side just to keep this in place. My first wig, their caps fit me really well so I really don't have to worry about it slipping and sliding. Just my adjustable straps in the back because I do have on my silicone grip and I didn't want it to be uncomfortable. Went in with my wax and I went around the hairline area and also in between the parting space area because it was kind of sitting up and I did not want it to look like that. So I just kind of went in between the parting space area and hot combed it down so that it could lay down flat on my head. And I feel like it laid down really well. My elastic band on just kind of let the lace melt in while I worked on styling this hair. I added a little bit of bump, not too much of a heavy bump. I bumped more on this side just because it is shorter versus this side. And when I turned around, you guys seen when I ran my fingers through it, it kind of gives you like a layered look. If I knew how to cut without messing up too much, I would probably go in and just cut this down like a little bit more. But that's just a personal preference. I would cut it down just a little bit more. But yeah, I bumped it more on this side just because I didn't want it to just kind of fall and look crazy. And I also tucked a little bit behind my ear. And then I pulled out some of this hair on the side to just kind of cover up my own sideburns. But I feel like it does look natural. A little bit of powder into the parting space area just to kind of help open it up. I only put like some powder right here, but I didn't have to put any in the hairline area just because this is a tinted lace. So once I added that mousse and everything, it just blended well into my skin. Did a really good job with plucking out the hairline on this unit. I feel like it looks very, very realistic. And I don't have to go in and worry about doing anything else. This unit is pretty much ready to wear straight out of the box. I didn't have to go in and do any trimming. I had to cut some of that excess lace off on the side. So I received a little bit of shedding. And then tangles, I really don't foresee much tangling with this unit. However, with yakky hair, the older it gets, I feel like the ends start to get dry. So just make sure you go in condition and also go in with some serum to help with that frizziness and also any flower. And it was pretty much ready to wear. It was very easy for me to install, super simple and easy. If you are thinking about cutting your hair because it is a summertime and it's time for those cuts to come out, you guys seen I just cut off my hair, but I definitely went through different phases of the longer bob, the short shorter bob. I even had a style similar to this before I cut it off even shorter. So if you want to try out a unit without having to commit to cutting your hair first just to see how it is, definitely check out their bobs on the website and also their other styles. Let me know what you guys think about this one. If you are feeling it, I am going to make sure to leave the links down below in the description area. Do not forget to subscribe to my channel. Once again, turn those notifications on, share and like this video and I'll see you guys next time. Bye guys.